渡る。Today, I will talk about ghost no tanya. Well, um, when a vocalist does vocalities like tam do b i l i d i ba, the second note of this da m、mm, m、mm, is m,、mm. and then you can make same kind of sound on saxophone. That's a ghost note. And here's a way to make ghost note、um, saxophone read on the mouthpiece and tongue.、Um, well, I use the tip of the tongue to mute the reed, the very top of the reed, and pull back the tongue very fast. The most important part of this technique is actually pulling the tongue very fast to make the next note very clear. And the feeling of pulling the tongue is like you grab hands. <laughs> I know it's difficult now, but、uh, you're gonna make it. Years ago, when I started to practice this ghost note, my tongue, especially the tip, hurt, so I compromised. So I started to do this with my side tip of the tongue and side top of the reed, like this. Nda, nda, nda. And once I got the sound, I took a long time to change the way into the center of the tongue and center of the reed. Like this. Then, now I can have pretty good contrast of the sound between the ghost note and the note after that. So, why don't I show you how to practice this ghost note? Starting with simple tam 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 tam, even it's not feeling, and some shuffle tam tam ta, and some rhythm tam tam ta tam ta. So, all through those、um, practice from the very slow tempo, and、uh, eventually you can do. I have to tell you one thing. This technique usually takes a long time to get, comparing to any other chops on the saxophone. 
and you should start to practice very very slowly and please make sure the note right after the ghost note is very clear that's the point and it's very interesting to talk about which note should be the ghost note in bebop style but I will do that later so please take time with the basic practice okay also uh, you may want to practice this ghost note with some fingering like Here is an example of a phrase in that multiple techniques are used at once. For example, phrase C, G, B flat, and I use a glisten down from C to G, and uh, I play the G with the ghost note. Without those, it's playing. So if I use a technique, glisten down from C to G and a ghost note on G. Then the contrast between G and B flat, da, is very clear now. Din, da. Din da. If you do tan, so did you enjoy the lesson? A saxophone can be your friend for life. Please don't forget this. Then, then, okay. Right. I'll be see you later.